Hello everyone. Hope you all are fine. Today on our behalf of CCGB desk, we come up with a new video. This video is all about a very important software named as Eagle Eye for PC. Okay. So in this video, we are going to discuss what is Eagle Eye for PC, what is feature and function and after that we will show you lively that how you download this particular software and how you install them and after that how you configure them and to get finally a live view of the camera so keep watching please like share our video and subscribe to our channel if you are new one so just let us start the video here we are providing the cms eagle eye for pc tutorial along with the detailed information needed to help it to help the av tech video surveillance system user client to help them to get live streaming and surveillance from the AV Tech CCB cameras. AV Tech is a leading global brand in the surveillance industry. Okay, so what is Eagle Eye for PC and what is AV Tech CMS? Both are same software. So AV Tech Technology Incorporation provides the software to their client to connect the AV Tech CCB product on PC or a smartphone to help and assist them in operating system as well and controlling the CCTV cameras without any difficulty. The application is available for Windows, iOS and Android operating system to free for free and download in, in the market. As far as characteristics and feature is concerned, it gives you a live view, it gives you, it gives you a PTZ control, it have a compression technologies it remotely remote it give you allow access you to remote location access is also available and the system requirement is again windows 7 and above intel core i3 or 5 any generations it gives 800 mb free space and a 4 gb ram is required so let us start our practical part so what you should do you should search for you should open your browser and search for Eagle Eyes for PC. Eagle Eye for PC. And after that, you find a website, CCB Desk. Just click on the link. When you click on the link, why I select every time this website? Because this website has almost all the CCB industry software. And not only the software, but it will show you how you download, how, how you install, and how you configure. And this video should be of that particular post. So just click on the download Eagle Eyes for PC. Okay. And after that, click on download. And click on download anyway. Now your download start you know now your file start downloading so let the download to be finished after that we will show you how you install this particular file and, and after that how you configure them and to make a camera live um to make and we are live so let's finish the download now download is finished just click on three dot button and go to your download page and you find that your file is here just click on show in folder and after that just right click on the downloaded file and click to extract once you click extract you find the same file name as a folder in a folder option so just open that folder and here you find your dot exe file or installer file or application file what you should do next is that right click on the application file and click on run as administrator now click on yes now click on the next and click on I agree and click on install for anyone using this computer now click on next now click on install 
and wait for a few minutes, a few times, and after that, once it is down installed successfully, you will get the successful notification. Now click on the next. Now click on the finish. It is better that you, you should click on the reboot now. Okay. Now when the download when the download installation is finished, you find a shortcut on the desktop. Just click on the on, on this and click yes. Now wait for a few seconds. Let the CMS to be ready. Once it is ready, you, it asks for username and password. So just click enter the username and click password and just click auto login CMS. If you click in the auto login CMS, then it won't ask you username and password again and again. Just click login. Now this is the interface of the CMS. Now what, sh what should you do? The first thing you should do, you should add your device. Here you just click on the device. You don't found any device. It means there is no device add. Just click on the add device. And here you should enter your device name. You can put any anything which you easily remember. Okay. Now enter IP address. If you want, want to connect with a local IP address, then enter local IP address. If you want to connect with a static IP address, just click static IP, just enter a static IP address. Now here, enter the port number. Now you ask for account and password. So don't be confused here. It asks for the account and password of the, of the device. Device means your DVR, NVR, whatever you are adding. So here I enter my device username and password and click on this add option. Now to start adding, once the device added, your device comes online like this. So thanks for watching and thank you. Have a nice day.